Tell me a little bit about your getting ready routine. You look gorgeous. Thank you. I was actually doing this thing for Seventeen Magazine earlier today, so my hair and makeup was almost done. And then I came home and got some touch-ups and uh, got dressed, and here I am. Yeah, you look gorgeous. Do you think that Foxface committed suicide? Because that is what some people are saying. I actually do not. Even though I've, I've seen all the evidence, and I think, you know, it's, it's very good evidence. But, you know, the game that she plays in the beginning, it's a matching game. You know, it's not what the plants are. It's just matching. And it's showing that she's very intellectual. She's a genius. She's so smart. But, I mean, in my mind, it gets to the point for her where she's so desperate in the books. I mean, it's as Katniss said. Like, if PETA had been tricking her, she would have figured it out because she was that smart. But because he was so naive and she was so hungry, and she was making her, you know, her living off of eating their food, I think that that's how she died. But um, I, I love all the different theories, and I actually kind of want to leave it open for everyone to discuss, because there have been some parts of me that are like, maybe she did. But I mean, when I was filming, I wasn't thinking of it that way. All right, so what were you doing when you heard the final box office number? Oh, I was in the desert on vacation with my family, and um, I kind of freaked out a little bit. I I just can't believe it's real. I mean, it's it's crazy. It's absolutely crazy. Um, so fortunate. How many times have you seen it in theaters, Fess Up? Three, four, four. Four. Well, okay. Four in like a couple halves because I went and saw the Lorax the other day and then after the Lorax was done, we popped into like three different Hunger Games theaters just to check it out. And we saw my crash scene with Katniss in once. That was really cool. Very nice. Um, yeah. So. All right. It's April uh, Fool's Day tomorrow. Do you have anything up your sleeve? I can't say. What if my parents are watching? They're, they're my biggest, they're my biggest uh, subjects. Valid, valid point, I guess. What kind of stuff do you have planned for summer? Um, I'm actually really excited. Hopefully I'm going to be working most of the summer. And then I'm also going to be going to Africa with my family for some part of it. So oh my god, wow. I'm so excited for that. I've always wanted to go. And um, yeah, it's going to be amazing. I feel like it's going to be such an eye-opening experience. Yeah. And so who are you looking forward to seeing today? Um, Michelle Obama, duh. <laughs> Who isn't? I'm. I mean, I'm such a huge fan. I love her. I think she's amazing, and I'm so excited to um, meet her. Thank you. Very cool. All right. Well, it's good seeing you. Thank you. All right. Have a good time, too. Thank you. Have a great time. You too. Bye.